going on here? What was that? How did you that? Just a bruise. Never knew what hit him. You won't leave her alive. They were nothing but losers. Leave my I friend knew alone. Was here, and you would have walked blindly into a trap. You should thank me. You dare challenge me? They were nothing but losers. Hello? that noise. here and defy my acolytes hmm what is it that brings you to underpal this is surely no place for the living Cadius sent me he wants me to kill you ah uh, the Sinon man yes he and I have history he's not aware of my presence here though or of the life I choose to lead ah Peaceful. Your history? Our history? <laughs> we are siblings, mages raised together from birth. We had an inborn gift. We were talented, oh, no doubt about it. But we had nowhere to turn for training. Cadius chose to grovel and put on the psychophant act to get in with the Synod. Now, he's well entrenched in that little group of impotent, politicking pretenders. I chose a different path. Different path. Reanimating corpses to kill people? I chose to follow in the footsteps of my father. He also had a talent for magic, and he had been disowned by my family for necromancy. I tracked him to this fortress, this underpal, and began working under him. He fell ill and eventually died. I was granted ownership of this den of necromancers by family right, though my claim was as always disputed. Now my father serves me well, as you have already seen. Already seen, zombie. Oh, yes. He was the doorman that let you in. But enough talk. It is time for me to test your might for myself. I'll kill you! Hello? 
Finally, thank you, Bob. Just like that, baby. Never knew what hit him. Well, you did it. The High Necromancer is dead. No doubt that's what you'll be telling my brother Cadius when you see him again. Oh, what joy for you, I'm sure. Savor it before it melts away. Why did you do this? Because my father was a necromancer. A vile, toxic, abusive man, but a powerful man nonetheless. He lorded it over me and my brother Cadius. When he finally left, I felt relief, but also curiosity. I wanted to see where he had gone, and what he was going to do. He came here to become a necromancer. I worked under him, and eventually grew powerful enough to off the bastard. <laughs> Though, everyone else just thought he'd fallen ill. Sometimes this one misses his old life in Bruma. Huh? The then levels down below the are filled with the corpses of, of the long of dead. Remnants of a necromancer's coven gone by, and useful tools for us. This place also has a certain... aura about it. Oh, I can't put my finger on it, and we don't know where it stems from, but it has a certain... I want you to kill me. Kill me in front of my father's shriveled corpse. It seems somehow... poetic. I don't care whether he still has his soul in his corpse. I just want a fitting end to his sordid tale. What if I spare you? Spare me? Why? I am a necromancer, and a failed one at that. Kill me! If you don't kill me, I'll just take matters into my own hands. There's nowhere for me to go anyway. Just... end it. You should... join the Synod or the... College of Whispers or something. Perhaps. Perhaps you are right. I am under no illusion. I can't just undo what has happened. But perhaps... This isn't a lost cause after all. Join the College of Whispers and work against Cadius. Work against Cadius? I... Well, I suppose the College of Whispers is more open and tolerant of necromancy. Hmm. Okay. Lead the way. I'm done with this place. Done with this life. Time to move on. Yay! Father, here's what you deserve. At last. Oh, look, another person who never got a chance to <laughs> admire my hair. Polymorphoi. Okay, we're going to take. Be more careful. Take her to the College of Whispers. Satisfying to the end. <laughs> I don't know why she did that. Okay. I'll cut you down. In the fight of its Another one hits the dust.
still with us or you guys kill her? Did they kill her? I didn't think she could die. They might have killed her. them off and yeah, she doesn't seem to be with us Okay. Let's try and sort out these guys. Yes? What is your business here? Uh. As much as I appreciate your enthusiasm, no. In our current state, Frostcrag's Spire is still not officially recognized as a proper Sinusure. Even if it was, in the Sinusure's current state, I do not yet have the power to appoint associates. You may wish to check back at a later date. Once the Imperial Council acknowledges our request, we can always use the members. Wait, no, okay. you ready to get moving yet? So, was there anything else? Uh, see you around. Who are you? Have we met? <laughs> I've changed my mind. How can I help with the portal? I knew I could count on you. Follow me.
you ready for what awaits you? What is it you need? What I need is to genuinely test these portals out and get them calibrated. I can't fix a problem I don't know exists after all. First, though, I need you to place a marker at the destination site. This ancient thing is set to send people to the old Bruma Mages Guild, which is now the home of the Synod in Bruma. Here's the beacon. I hid it inside this boot here. Just put it in the main hall. With it in place, I'll hopefully be able to focus the portal's trajectory directly to the beacon's location before you test this thing. Won't the Synod object? The Synod might not like it if they suspect you are helping us out. But you already knew that, so I'll see you back here when you're done. Oh, I almost forgot. And it's not like me to forget, so I'd best tell you before I forget again. Bruma's quite the long walk from here. Eh. Uh. Excellent question, Carlin. Allow me to tell you. I can teleport you to Bruma. Oh, yes. The glistening frozen city high atop the Gerald Mountains, if my memory serves, and I believe it does. Traditionally, teleportation magic uses a focus. That's what the boot is for, to focus the magic, to make sure we end up precisely where we intend to. It's also why, throughout Tamriel's history, mages have employed mark and recall spells, invocations of divine intervention and the like. However, I believe I've perfect... well, nearly perfected, mostly, a spell to teleport you to an imprecise location. That means I can teleport you to Bruma with a simple flick of my wrist. Expedite your journey, and a lot of fun on the way, I'd expect. However, as I alluded to, I can't send you to any particular location in Bruma. Imprecise magic. So no direct travel to the Conclave, I'm afraid. Still, the theory behind the spell is sound. Mostly, I think. So if you want me to teleport you to Bruma, now, or, well, any time, just let me know. Uh... Where are you going? Okay. Yeah, I think that necromancer, I think the party members killed her. 